Hey everybody, it is Howard III here for Black Hollywood Live. I'm at the Ghostbusters premiere in Los Angeles, California. Now, you're gonna wanna stay tuned because we might have Melissa, we might have Kristen, we never know. But somebody special is coming up next. Well, it, it was just uh, uh, just kind of a, a slippery, sticky mess. Really, it was our, my special effects guys had to figure out the, the the you know the recipe for it, and a lot of it is sort of non toxic. It's obviously non toxic, but it's some of it comes from the agricultural industry, and then there's not non toxic paint that they use, and uh, I think I, I was told there's a little bit of tapioca flour in there. I could be wrong, so you could eat it, but I would not. And what was the most extreme thing the girls had to do? Like. Physicality in the we have a whole big fight scene where they take on a, an army of ghosts in Times Square, and uh, that was uh, weeks of training for them, and then days and days of shooting with them in harnesses and being flown through the air, and taking on stuntmen who were dressed as ghosts, and uh, that was quite physical. They they left bruised but happy at the end of the day. Last question: Did it hurt your feelings when Trump was naysaying the movie before it even? You know what? All I can say is today people, because of the internet, feel like they know everything about what you're doing because they see so much reporting on it, see so much many leaks and from behind the scenes. All I can do is say, I can't control any of that. All I can control is the movie I'm making and the fact that when you get in that theater, I want you to have a great time in just under two hours and laugh and just forget your troubles. Now, Mr. Paul, you did all of the stunts before the girls did it. What was that like? <laughs> well, you know what? I, Growing up, I wanted to be a stuntman. I was actually, I went, I went to a career fair in my grade school once in Michigan and came home very angry because the stuntman's union was not uh, was not there. Uh, so I'd live out my dreams every time. So they're like, we're not sure we want to do this. It's like, well, guess what? I'll do it for you. And I have the greatest time. <laughs> right. So you just enjoy getting out there, rolling around, kicking butt. Well, it's under the guise that I will never make somebody do something that I would not do myself. Uh, but it's really more for fun for me. Right, right. Now, what was it like directing these ladies? Have you directed um, Kristen before? Kristen yeah. Wiig? Oh, yeah. Kristen and I worked, uh, Kristen and Melissa and I worked on uh, Bridesmaids together and had so much fun. And then Melissa and I have obviously done two more movies after that. But then to bring in Kate and Leslie, who were newcomers to, uh, you know, to, to us and our group, was so much fun because it just, you know, their chemistry went through the room. So it was exciting. Thank you, Mr. Paul. Thank you.